What a humdrum lad you are. Hello, hello! How's it going, everybody? All you humdrum lads, welcome in and welcome back to another stream. Huh? We are back today playing some Rise of Ronin because I'm probably one of the only goddamn 10 people on the planet playing it, unfortunately, because, uh, well, it chose to come out the same day as Dragon's Dogma 2. So, uh, yeah. That is unfortunately, that, that is pretty unfortunate for the game because not only has Dragon Dogma 2 been in like every single news article for gaming recently because of all the controversy, but in general, it's actually a really good game. You know, people waited, God, how long did we wait for the new Dragon's Dogma? For me, it was like five years and I came into it late. I can't exactly remember when that game came out, but it has been like nearly a decade so, obviously the hype was going to be the maximum for that game. And unfortunately for this game, I don't know why it didn't just choose to delay it. Because um, it was obviously going to just get trampled and not talked about. Like, it's, it's unfortunate. Because I fucking love Team Ninja. I have been playing Team Ninja games since Neo 1. So it's been quite a while now. I have a very long history with Team Ninja at this point. And... Basically, every single game they've made, I've absolutely loved. I've loved their their evolution as of recent when it comes to their games from, like, Neo to Wulong. And I've been hearing some things about this game. I've been hearing a lot of people, like, not really complain, but almost, like, I don't know, like, say it's just not one of their bests. And... I bet it's still pretty good. Like, I guess that's how good in my head that Team Ninja is, that even one of their best, even one of their, that's not their best, is probably still pretty damn good. Um, you know, it's it's similar to From Software, right? Like, would you say Dark Souls 2 is bad? Actually, don't answer that because I know some of you goddamn haters. I know some of you hate Dark Souls 2, but in general, Dark Souls 2 is probably, in my opinion, the worst of the Souls games, but still an amazing, great game compared to many, many games. So I'd imagine we have a similar situation here where Rise of Ronin just doesn't live up to like Neo and Neo, one, Neo 2 and then like Wulong even. So I guess we're going to see how this goes. Hopefully the game's fantastic. I'm, uh, I'm very excited to play it. The only one that I didn't play as of recent, which I, I kind of feel that I... I really would have liked is the uh the final fantasy one they did the strangers in paradise that's the only one that i really wish i would have played it just when it came out i there was so many things that were out at the time that i needed to play that were more important and then by the time like i was gonna get around to playing it like nobody mentioned it and like i was like i don't know if there's interest in it so uh yeah i guess we're gonna see how this one is i i hope it's good i i do really hope it's good you have toenail, toenail vanish? What does that mean? Like, your toenails disappear. What a humdrum lad you are. Oro Oscar, thank you for the 45 long month sub. Ciara, thank you for the 26 months. Scruffer, with the 16 months. Oh, varnish. Like paint, ah, I see. You have toenail paint in this? Did they paint their toenails in this era? I'm not sure. That's cool. Miyazaki's probably been customizing his feet nonstop. He probably still hasn't gotten into the game. All right, now let me go ahead and see what options we got. So I did change a couple things. I changed up, like I took out motion blur, I prioritized FPS. 
there's a way to prioritize graphics. So if you want better graphics and don't mind a lower frame rate, there's like little ray tracing. I'm just going to do FPS, uh, motion blur off, depth of field, noise filter, like a film grain. I don't know how good that's going to look. Should I just leave it on? I guess we'll leave it on and we'll see how it looks. I can kind of see it here. It doesn't look too bad. I'm wondering if it'd be able to, if I'd be able to notice it if I take it off. Uh, it kind of looks the same, to be honest. All right. Without further ado, let's go ahead and start off our new game. So we have actual difficulties for this one. Now, I have my own opinion on difficulties. I... I always feel like there should be just no difficulty and it's whatever the developer chooses and like that should be the, the default difficulty. I know how difficult that is in terms of like there's so many people who sometimes want to play a game and, and don't have the ability to play like, you know, like there's probably a lot of people who have not been able to play Neo and stuff like that because of like no difficulty and how difficult the game actually is. So I understand why there's difficulties. I, I wish there wasn't. But in my head, right? So this is my thought process. Team Ninja loves difficult games. They are, you know, notorious with Ninja Gaiden and Neo. So I'm assuming Twilight is their, was their default, right? I'm assuming that was their default. And then they just kind of dwindled it down a little bit for everybody else. That's my thought process. So I'm going to play as Twilight. Because in my dumb head, I assume that's their uh, their default. So let's go ahead and play on Twilight, which is the hardest difficulty. So we're going to see how this game is. I'm excited. Performance mode is in here. I think there is a performance mode. There's a performance mode, and then there's a um, uh, FPS. Also, you guys can let me know how loud all this is. I'm also playing Japanese because I heard the English voices aren't that great. Plus, Japanese VO is always the best. Is he bringing me my letter to Hogwarts? What's Japanese Hogwarts? Like Jujutsu Kaisen? All the katanas. My man didn't even put it up to his goddamn shoulder. Oh, they burned them. Oh, what if they forged the bodies to the katanas and then it makes a super powerful katana? That's what Neo would be. Uh-oh. Run, kids! They were not kind to kids in this era. Ooh. Damn, Granny, good shit. It's freaking Lady Butterfly. Dude, she's a beast. She has a cane sword, by the way. Separately formidable, together, unstoppable. What a humdrum lad you are. There are a couple humdrum lads, aren't they? Sweet. Alright, so we have the base. By changing your body, you'll be deleting the current appearance profile. Are you sure? Yeah, I want to see. So, you can either play as two females or two males, huh? 
So like uh, maybe like an older brother and then a younger brother and then it's the same for female? Older sister, younger sister? I'll play as a male. Um, my elbow and knee angle. Yeah, that's the very first thing that I actually wanted to edit. Thank God. Uh, Ashen one, thank you for the two months sub and the gifted sub. I appreciate that very, very much. My Hero Academia, you think would be like, yeah, I guess either Jujutsu Kaisen school or I guess My Hero Academia school. What happened to My Hero Academia, by the way? Is this still going on? I stopped watching it like a couple years back. I think like a year or two ago. I used to love that show. The last, the last thing I watched was the season where the main character puts the girl on his back so she can regenerate him and so he could use his full power and she continuously regenerates him. That was like the finale. Alright. The max extended elbow and knee angle. That's good. So we have type 2, type 1, skin color, Oh my god, you can make him pale as a ghost. Let's make him just a, a little a little darker. There we go. Kind of match my skin tone. There we go. That's kind of my skin tone a little bit. I would say I may be a little bit lighter because I don't go outside, but. Oh god. I'm going to try my best not to spend too long this character creator, okay? Let's do that. Number two. Actually, we'll do one. Actually, we'll do that one that has scars because that one looks the coolest. Wait, undergarment type? What the fuck does that mean? How do I take off his clothes to see his undergarments? Is there a way to take off? So I take off his clothes? Undergarment L3, R3. How's my health? Just heard in the last video. Oh yeah, I'm still a little bit sick. Uh, I'm kind of at the end stages of it. Everything is okay. The only thing I have now is my... Uh, every time at the end of any time that I get sick, the last thing that, that comes out is I get real nasally and my nose gets real congested. So I'm kind of at the end stages of that. So if I sound a little bit weird, a little bit nasally, that's the reason why. Am I excited for Shadow of the Earth Tree? What is that? I've never heard of it. But welcome in, everybody. Just joining on in. Alright, I'm gonna go with just that. Undergarment type. Uh, I'm assuming they're talking about his underwear. Can we make it pink? <laughs> pink underwear? There we go. That's good. Once my character takes off his clothes, he's gonna have a pink loincloth. Alright, face shape. Forehead depth, cheekbone, cheekbone width. I wanted to make him look like me. I got big old chubby cheeks. Jaw height. Jaw width. Okay, chin height. Do I have a tall chin? My chin is six foot one. Chin depth. Chin definition. There's so many options for just a chin. Mandible depth. What the fuck does that mean? Oh, like my, if you have an underbite? <laughs> Chin middle width, okay. Hair, aging. No, hey, I don't have wrinkles. What's the max wrinkles that I can give him? He kind of doesn't even look like he has wrinkles. Combined adjustments, oh, I see. I do have a lot of eye wrinkles just because 
Well, my sleep schedule is always messed up. Okay, it's not that bad. It's more like I have bags under my eyes. Okay, eyebrows. Honestly, my eyebrows look just like that, so. Can I, I can make them asymmetrical, so I have one big eye and one little eye. Wait, what's this? Eye bag puffiness. There we go. Max, max that bitch out. Oh, I do have a very distinct eyelid depth. I don't even know what's changing there. The height of my eyelid. Irises and pupils. Now, I'm going to be honest. I wish my eyes were that color. Look, if they were like light brown, I have the darkest, might as well be black eyes. Like my eye color literally looks like that. Like the way the character's eyes look like that, like basically black. I wish my eyes were fucking light like that, man. Yo, this character creator is good so far. Listen, I made my monster in Dragon's Dogma, okay? I want to make a, a good character. <laughs> hey, Port, what's up, dude? Pupil type. I can't really tell the difference because his eyes are too dark. My nose. How does my nose look? What a humdrum lad you are. He is kind of a humdrum lad, yeah. Teeth? Yellow and scraped. <laughs> no, we gotta there we go, we gotta give him yellow teeth. They didn't have fucking toothpaste at this time. Sort of darker, not perfect teeth. There we go. Presets for his lips. Okay, mouth height, mouth size, mouth corner position, ears. Oh shit, we can make him an elf. And then drooping earlobes for some reason. Oh my god, he's a mouse. You can turn your character into a mouse. You can customize it too and go crazy. Okay. So you could always edit and change it later. Preset hairs. That actually kind of looks like the way I cut my hair recently. Yo, it's Melina's hair. What is that? That's a hairstyle? I thought he was wearing a raccoon skin on his head. There we go. What do you think, Valentine? Is this how I this how I look now, right, with my new haircut? Yo, Radagon. Oh my God, what is this hair? That's amazing. <laughs> Damn it! Honestly, seeing this hair kind of makes me want to. Uh, it kind of makes me want to make a female character. Fuck. No, I'll stick with a I'll stick with the male character. Uh oh, by the way, my video on YouTube that I was uploading is not processing, so that's not good. Hopefully, it processes. So if it doesn't process, I would have to get off and up upload it again. But not now; probably a little bit later. 
Uh, let's see. We hear in Rat Milk Incorporated did not condone pod racism against mice kind. <laughs> hey, I don't. I'm not racist against mice. They're racist in general. Mice are a racist bunch. Um, I guess we can just go with like this hair. But turn it black. Oh, that actually was kind of sick with the highlights. Yo, I'm about to get some fucking b white highlights. Like, that shit looks kind of sick. The color of my tip is that color. Gray hairs. That's what I'm going to look like in two years. Do me and super. Can I also edit the other character? If I can do that, I'll make my brother as the other character. Hairstyles. Wait, there's base hair and then you could change your bangs? What the fuck? That's pretty cool. I've never seen like double like hairstyles like that. Where you can kind of change it. Pretty cool to be honest. I like that. Hair at sides. Oh my god. I thought that said something about. I thought that said toe for a moment. Marcus tits. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Do I prefer this or Dragon's Dogma 2? Um, I'd probably say I prefer Dark Souls 2. That's the facial hair I have in real life. <laughs> oh, man. Can I do that, but like thicker? So it doesn't look... I look like a... Like somebody in a telenovela. I want this, but not fucking point. Actually, no, I don't want that mustache. Facial hair color. Wait, I can get colored tips on my fucking mustache? Yo, I could get mustache highlights. Yo, it's red. I can see it. Facial hair... Gr Gradation width. What does that mean? Oh, for the color. I see. Mustache. I could change my mustache. Yay! <laughs> that's good. That's what, that's what I could grow my mustache to look like. I can't believe you could change your mustache. That kind of looks like my mustache, I guess. Hey, Mio the Doge, thank you so much for the 10 freaking dollar donation. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. And hey, Patrick, yeah, I'm feeling better. Definitely feeling a lot better. Poochie Panda, thank you for the 31 months. Uh, El Payaso, thank you for the 25 long months. Rat Milk Incorporated with the $5. Shout out to my number one sponsor. Uh, Killer Cutchin, thank you for the 16 long month sub as well. Now, do I want to put my dreamer mustache or my real mustache? Wait, what's the difference between these two? I guess one of them is just thicker. There we go. Length. I can't change the curliness of my mustache. That's bullshit. Beer type. Nah. If anything, my beard grows out fucking patchy. My I just, I cannot grow like facial hair on my sides. I don't know why. What's up with my face? I can't grow facial hair on the sides. You know what? I also can't really grow. It just doesn't grow back. I have really long hair, but my my uh, what do you call it? The fucking sideburns. 
th those just do not grow out. Every time I go get my hair cut, the guy's like, oh, you do you cut your sideburns? I'm like, nope, they just don't grow. Would I grow my mustache and curl it at the end? Yes. I know Valentine would love it. All right, we'll just do that since that's kind of pretty close to what my facial hair looks like, I guess. Well, it's kind of that, but without the tip. <laughs> no, it's actually that because I have the thing under my lip as well. All right, makeup, I always wear blush. Should we see how I'd look with eyeliner? <laughs> so apparently that's what I'd look like with eyeliner. This is more of a, of a Japanese cooler, hotter version of me. So in a way, the better version of me. Face paint? Wait, nail polish? Oh my, oh, look at my underwear. You can see it. Oh, that's what I'm gonna be wearing? Holy shit. <laughs> oh yes, dude. You know how I look like? I look like party boy. Fucking Pontius. I'm gonna take this thing off and start dancing on people in the taverns. Holy shit. No, I won't change my, my huh? nails. Face markings. Dude, that's amazing. I have a tattoo of a swirl on my face. I'm a big fan of, uh... What the hell is that? Yeah, let me just get that on my fucking forehead. <laughs> Holy shit. Kabuki man. Should I get a lightning bolt like Harry Potter? I might get a I might get a Harry Potter lightning bolt. Where does he have it again? He has it like over his eyelid or some shit, right? This is uh my scar. And it's not because I'm the... Oh, like Vegeta, maybe, actually. That's way better. The Majin. Majin Prod. That's way better. And stupid-ass Harry Potter. There we go. Perfect. What color is, is it in Dragon Ball Z? It's black, right? The M? Or is it white? Hold on, let me look up. Majin Vegeta. Okay, it is... It is black. Dude, I just looked up Majin Vegeta for the first time. His fucking design when he's Majin Vegeta is so goddamn badass. I haven't seen it in a while. This is like a discount Majin tattoo. body oh my god dude the pink underwear is amazing i love it i'm keeping it a hundred percent should i make it like me in real life extremely tall seven foot nine it's actually a disability head size <laughs> i, I kind of want to do that should we do that a fucking massive head it kind of looks like the old basketball games where you used to be able to put big head mode on. No, I'll do normal. Nah, fuck it. I want him to have a big ass head. That shit makes me laugh. Wait. Can I? What's the max weight that I can put on me? I don't have abs. It just makes him more ripped. What the fuck? I wanted to make him a fat pig. He's just more ripped. I guess he's more jacked than more ripped. Muscle mass, 0%. 
Nah, we'll make it, we'll make we'll make him cool. Wait, what does it look like if you go max? Jesus Christ, zero percent body fat. He's a fucking beast. Make a normal character? Okay, okay. I'll make his head tiny. Normal sized. Not tiny. Actually, now it actually does kind of look tiny, so I need a bigger head to kind of match the body. There we go. Oh, wait, there's more? Body hair? I don't got fucking body hair. What am I, uh, an animal? Body markings. Oh, yeah. Wait, so if I do like this, does it cover the whole body? I want a picture of a frog on my abs. Oh, I see. Okay. I thought we were going to be able to do the one that's all the writing. And it was just going to cover your whole body. Let's do that. I'll put that on my... Uh... No, not on my back. I wanted to put this... Sort of on my shoulder. I don't think it's going to go all the way over there. Yeah, it disappears into my shoulder. Max, wait, I could give it a shine. And then I want a tattoo of a frog on my abs. You know how Conor McGregor has like a the lion or whatever? It's like a lion mixed with a, a gorilla or some shit. I have a frog. His name's Frogland. There we go. Give it give it shine as well. What a humdrum lad. Body markings. We'll do another tattoo. What other tattoo should we get? <laughs> the spiral? It could be like uh what's that Junji Ito? Uh Tom Tom not Tomio. There's a full body one? Is there? Tattoos. Oh, I see. Oh my lord. Holy hell. Ozumaki, that's it. Should we put like straight up Yakuza tattoos on us? Were the Yakuza even around around this era? Um, I look like The Rock here with that tattoo. That's the tattoo that The Rock has. This one's yours? You put this on your body? Oh my god. A spiral on my booty cheeks. Maybe I can, yeah. I could try. Let me see. I don't think it's going to reach down there. No, it doesn't. That actually kind of looks cool on your back. I'll do that. But, I'm going to make it red so it looks like a target so they know where to aim when they try to stab me. They're just going to aim there with their fucking swords and stab me in my back now. I dare them to. I would never turn my back on an enemy. These are the worst tattoos ever. Okay, that look honestly, that's it. That makes me laugh. How do I test this? Play? Which one do you guys think sounds more like me? Without the nasaliness. Hey, Miss B Valentine, gifting a sub to Bear Sully? What you did it from your account? Oh no. You're supposed to do it from. Oh. Well, thank you so much, Miss Valentine. I appreciate it. 
Thank you, thank you. That's very kind of you. That came out of her own pocket. I can't say that one. <laughs> Wait, what about this? That she doesn't sound bad. You know what? Let's do that. I kind of like that, actually. I don't know why. I changed it, and I actually kind of like it. Alright, what other options do we have? Can we save it? Me. What a humdrum lad you are. Alright. Oh my god, I ruined everything and I take them off. Alright, I like it. Finalized creation. Oh, now we have another one. Okay. Somebody gave me the good idea that I should make the next one look like my brother, which I kind of like that idea as well. So, I'm going to make this one very quickly look like my brother. Who looks like me, but with a uh, shorter hair. Okay, hair. Aging. He has to be older. <laughs> yeah, that old. <laughs> a fucking old man. That's who we're gonna make. Laugh lines? No, I don't know why. He's, he's definitely not fucking that old. There we go. Eyebrows, eyes, irises, pupil, nose, teeth. We gotta give him fucked up teeth as well, like me. <clears throat> you know what? My brother's gonna be an elf. That's why I have mystical powers. You don't realize it, but I'm half elf. I don't even know if there is, <coughs> excuse me, kind of phlegmy today. I don't even know if there is like shorter hair like his. <laughs> this would be the closest, to be honest, even though this is a goddamn mohawk. You know what, though? They have like a, what mohawks are actually supposed to look like. <laughs> Base hair, bald. Let me see. Can I do actually like base hair that, right? So then we add to that, or how does that work? Um, maybe we could give my brother a bowl cut. Or, or that. <laughs> um, oh, there we go. Wait, no. I thought that was kind of like his hair. Give my brother uh, pigtails. One pigtail. The hair in this game is fucking cool. What is that? That looks sick. <laughs> Turn that gold. That's a Super Saiyan. Alright, this is probably the closest we're going to get to his hair. Mm -mm -mm. I guess he doesn't have bangs. <laughs> Okay, that's good. Facial hair. 
We're making this one fast. I guess he has more of a beard. Mustache? Yes, my brother has that mustache. Um, should I give him a kabuki mask? A skeleton mask. <laughs> or a tattoo of a deer on his forehead. There you go. He has that in real life too. Brother did mention he had a bowl cut when he was in middle school. Yeah, we both did. We both grew up with bowl cuts because my mom used to cut our goddamn hair. And she would always give us bowl cuts. So the first 12 years of my life, I had a bowl cut. All right, I think that looks good. That's that's my brother. I don't think we have to edit it much. Maybe we can make his eyes a little bit bigger. Wait, we got to make his undergarments. We'll make his peach colored. <laughs> we'll give him type 2 undergarments, which, again, I don't know how to check. Oh, wait, the fingernails. That's how you check, right? Um, face, hair, facial hair, makeup. Was it makeup? Lipstick, blush, nail polish. Oh, so undergarment two is just shorts. I see. I don't know why in my head I thought it was going to give us the female's undergarments. Okay. I think we're, uh, I think we're good. I think we're good. So that's me. And that's my brother. I I put more time into mine. Can we get a toe look? Excuse me? How do we even check our toes? That is B Valentine asking for toes. How surprising. Not. Um, nail polish? Oh, toenails. Hey, yo! Feet! This is not toenail pain. My toenails actually just died. Frostbite. They got frostbite. For free? That's crazy. I can't believe they just give them out for free. Okay, I think I'm ready. Yes. That took f way longer than I thought it was going to take. Okay, as a swordsman polishes a blade, so too does a bladesmith sharpen the veiled edges of their charge. Choose a blade sharpening origin to determine the veiled edges' initial abilities and special skills, as well as weapons with which they excel. Okay, interesting. So we can be more dex related. A seducer. I'm a natural liar. Learn the art of being charismatic and charming. Efficient and, pra efficient and practiced movements allow for efficient Kai usage. And will also be very clever with words to deceive people. Which one describes me the best? As a, I am quite the sapper. A beginner? <laughs> no, guys. I'm a killer. Alright. Ninjutsu. Completely... Complete highly dangerous missions, trained in utilizing various equipment and can assassinate multiple enemies at once. I kind of would like to go for a um, a dexterity build, so we're good with dual katanas she and guns. While doing the feet, so it literally wouldn't have been free to view. Ran ads while looking at the feet, so it wouldn't have been free to view. That's, damn, that's a good ass idea. Thank you, Phoenix, for the 300 bits. Beal, thank you for the 31 months. Fractal, thank you for the 78 long months sub. Uh, Maiku, thank you so much for the 9 months. Spankin' Rankin with the 49 long months. Meal the Doge with another 10 freaking dollars. I appreciate that very, very much. Thank you. Pineapple Parakeet, thank you as well for the 30 months sub. All right, let's go with uh, Breaker. Yes.
That's both of us. Sweet. Oh, I can select which character? Yeah, I'm gonna select me. Cool, so this is us in game now. That's me. When do we already start doing a mini menu simulator? Yo, chickens! What the hell was that? Wait, we have fists? Cool. Hey, Panics, thank you for the raid, man. Welcome in. I don't know what that is. What am I gonna use? Ooh, out of all the different weapons? So we have a pole arm? Normal attacks, advanced attacks, charge attacks. Huh. So is key like your stamina? So does this not have a charge attack or is that the charge attack? Oh, it's kind of slightly char more charged. That's the advanced attack. So are these the stances? Oh, these are your special abilities. Interesting. No, I didn't make a monster. Well, kind of. It's me. You could consider me a monster if you want. Then we have a katana. Okay. Cool katana moves. That's weird. Can I also test out the other weapons? Spear? What is that? Strong attack? Kinda looks like a parry. Super parry. Then we have paired swords. Which I think is one of the ones that I'm the best with. Like, my character's supposed to be really good with paired swords. Cool. Alright, we'll go with paired swords, and then for our second weapon... Uh, how do we change weapons? Up and down? What is this? Oh, the Odachi! Okay. That's cool. Oh, shit. That's cool, dude. So it said I can pick two weapons, right? So we have regular weapon. I want to go with paired swords and Odachi. <clears throat> Unless I can only use one. Maybe I'll be able to swap later. Alright, we'll stick with this. Brother, I love the tattoo of a deer on your head. It's looking good. Wait, continue with... Choose another weapon. Choose another blade sharpening origin. No, I'll choose another weapon. Sorry, bro. 
I think it's just the last two that I grab or no? R1 up on D-pad. Oh, okay. Let's do this. Odachi, big katana, and then little katanas. There we go. That's our weapons. Yes. Unsheath. Can I hit a chicken? Block and then dodge. Okay, I see. I want to hit a chicken. You fucking chicken! Who's this guy? He just tends to the chickens. Oh my god, he fucking broke my stance. I thought you were just tending the chickens. Who are you? Medicine. What's my prize? Free chicken? Oh my god, I almost fell. Martial skills. R1, use Kaido Unleash, or key to unleash powerful attacks. Each martial skill is a special attribution. Maybe modified repeatedly pressing or holding the button. Okay. Okay, I wanted to see if that one had anything different. Oh, you can charge that. Cool. Okay, that was a... Give me the option for... What a dick! Give me that shit. I don't know why I keep wanting to run with L3. Sprint. Hold and release circle. Sprinting does not deplete key without... While outside of battle. Okay. Hey, Patricia, what's up? Interacting with a Veiled Edge banner will restore your health as well as replenish your medicine pills. Okay. Is that a bonfire? Equipment. Alright, so we got three heals. So then now we fight the boss? Are you gonna go play Mortal Kombat? Oh, it's the old lady. Oh my god, we saw her whoop ass. We ain't gonna do shit. Hey, Mithra, welcome in, dude. Cross swords and show me all you've learned. Alright, so we're supposed to fight our own brother. Counter spark. Use a counter spark to deflect and neutralize enemy attacks. With triangle, deflecting attacks with counter sparks will cause enemies to become temporarily panicked. That's weird. Oh wow, how precise is it? Damn, that shit has to be precise. Also, triangle's a weird button for it. Counter spark change. You can deflect any repeated attacks of an enemy combo using counter sparks. Deflecting one attack in combo will not cause an enemy to become panicked, so rather than focusing on deflecting everything, it must be best to block. Counter spark in time with enemies' combos, I see. So it is like Sekido parries, but instead of like regular block, it has its own dedicated like counter. Best way to drain enemy keys is to first reduce their maximum key. 
Panic the enemies with counter spark, then attack significantly reduce their maximum key. Okay. <laughs> Critical hits? Oh, I whooped his ass! And then we finish him. Oh. No, we gotta revive him now. <laughs> Aniki! Fight me, old woman! I'm ready for you. Oh shit! I, hey, yo, I was joking! Hey, yo! I was joking! Oh shit. Oh! Oh my god, I wasted all my stamina. Let's go, you old bat. Oh my god, she's strong. Veiled twin twin unit. You can switch controls between either veiled edge member at any time. Okay. L1 and then up, huh? That's cool. And then my what is my dumbass character just stand in there? What up, Granny? I'm behind you! Let's go! She's like, go easy on me, young man. Nah, she wouldn't want that. That's our teacher. She's taught me everything I know. Who do you think first taught me how to eat walrus bones? Got her. That's cool. I like the fact that you can kind of switch between each character. That's a real interesting mechanic. Kind of a little bit tough to do in battle and stuff, but... This would be a funny moment to realize I only speak English. What's that? My reply is just, huh? Kill Perry. Huh? Prod likes to punch old ladies. I tend to punch old women a lot in video games. Are you ready to head to the black ships? Yes. Hey. Oh, my video on YouTube isn't processing. I think my YouTube video got fucked up. I might need to up upload it again. I might have to get off sooner than I thought I would have today. That's annoying. Not, not now, but like maybe an hour and a half. Sorry, guys. We'll see how much we can get done in like an hour and a half.
What a humdrum lad they are. Leviathan, thank you for the 36 long month sub. Now you need to win the war with a wooden sword only? That's easy. It's not like they have guns or anything. Was that Napoleon? Did I get sick? I, I have been sick for like the last two weeks. It's going away now though. This is 1853, my god. PlayStation wasn't even invented yet. Alright, so what do we need to do? Jump in the water? You think I can get eaten by a shark? I'm going to find Titanic. Oh no, shit. <laughs> Titanic. Take one of them. Switch targets. I'll get under the camera. Okay. I'll take that one. Come up to water, approach an enemy without being noticed, and press. There we go. See? Cool. Wait, aren't they just gonna see us instantly? They're right- Dog, they're right there! Oh well. A Japanese man is now on board! Different types of attacks. Normal enemies, formidable foes. Leaders, followers, so there's different types. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, I have a real sword! I thought we were gonna have our wooden one. Oh my god, my stamina. I need- Wow, I need to watch my stamina. Fuck me. I'll take on the leader. Cool. Check him. Check his rectum. I mean, I mean, check his uh, pockets. For like loot stuff. Let's go down here. Okay, so there is also like the stealth gameplay. Assassinating enemies. Crouch. Walk lightly. Tilt. Okay, so actually it does matter how lightly and how slow you go. Alright, we got one. What? Dog, his body fell through the ship. The ship ain't real. Oh my god, the ship's not real. It's a figment of my imagination. I hear rats. That's a sign of a good game, usually. Mice. Yeah, it's all a simulation. I go, <gasps> and then I wake up. Wait, what the fuck? There's somebody over here. I have to like spam R1 to see if they have anything that I can loot before they fall through the ground. Can we steal any plans? Find the Commodore's cabin. Okay. It's probably the room that doesn't have rats in it. Hey, Ibrahim, what's up? Welcome in. How am I liking it so far? Yeah, it's fucking awesome so far. But we have only uh, been playing oh, a little bit. Deflecting enemies' gunfire and other such attacks will be... Oh my god. Oh, it's such a weapon on fire if you do it right? That's badass. 
Ooh, what up, bitch? Sick. I got his gun, too. Rifles are noisy, but enable powerful attacks at range. Okay. Oh, there's a fucking something up here. I don't know what that was. Gold? Shit. Fuck it! Oh, well, that did no damage. Oh! Oh shit, I found a hole! Hey, yo, that's my bad. My bad, brother. <laughs> One. Oh my god, they're just constantly falling down the hole. Are they fighting on the ladder? What are they doing? What the fuck was that? Wait, was that my brother? Oh, that was him. Oh shit! Okay, so he has... What is this? This is Yodachi. So it's, I think it might be the same as like Neo, where when the enemies are really strong, you can get a headshot and they fall down so you can repost them. That looks cool, though. All right, we gotta go this way, maybe? Follow the coal. The coal always leads to the enemy. What the fuck? Grappling hook in battle, we can use a grappling hook as a weapon locked onto enemy certain objects like barrels can be thrown. R2, then use a grappling rope to pull an enemy, hold R2. Huh? Boom! They say time to suffer? I don't know who I threw that at. Oops. Shit. Dear God. Oh, shit, he cut his arm off. That was sick. This guy's over here suffering. How do we put him out of his misery? <laughs> Shoot him in the head? Go in there. Okay. Yo, I'm liking the combat so far, though. It's fucking sick. Ooh. Why is that chest floating? Things happen so oddly out here in the ocean. I got a saber. Obtain a new weapon. Switch to your primary. Let me see. Equipment. So we have... All these are all the different abilities. Jin. Dual swords are Odachi. Then we have the saber. So this is the saber. That looks cool. 
I'll try it out. Uh, where are we going? Upstairs, downstairs. I think we actually were supposed to be upstairs. Maybe a little subsection? Does this game have gravity? Yes. I see. Oh shit. Thank God he was fixing that chest I'm about to steal. <laughs> Look at his head. Ah, oh, hey yo. Damn, he throwing it back though. God damn. Hey, chill. cut that part me in the future huh oh shit oh my god oh you idiot get in the room and help oh my god it's an aggro though Oh my god, that was brutal. Fuck, I need to get used to this combat. It definitely seems like you can't spam as much as, uh, like Neo or Wulong or something. So I think I need to be more cautious about that. Oh shit. Ooh. Really? Dude, that shit is fucking violent. Oh, hell yeah. You can switch between them? Yeah. Ooh, new rifle. Oh, dude, this is gonna be a menu simulator, isn't it? I can already see it coming. Hopefully it won't be as bad as, like, Wulong and, and Neo. There's so much machinery, it should cover my footsteps, right? Oh wait, I've been here already, these guys are dead. Can I say Ohio Skib? Oh my, I'm not saying all that. Is that for Skibbity Toilet? There's a little fruit cart. Is this the Commodore's cabin? Ooh, I'm gonna steal his fancy things. The captain's cabin key. Harry's report. Oh shit, hell yeah, let's steal his personal stuff. Blackened silver saber. This is another saber? It's just an even better saber. Has anybody done a full wooden sword run already in this game? I like the characters, they look cool. It's Napoleon! この日本こそ誰にも仕留められなかったモビーディックだ。この巨大なクジラに森を突き立て。<laughs> 
Oh my god, he's about to take both of us on. What a badass. Dude. Hey, Ark, what's up, man? Oh, he's got a gat. Try that shell deflecting right now. There you go. No way, he just dodged a bullet like a superhero. Alright. Enemy martial skills. To avoid martial skills of enemies developed by a murderous red aura, you'll have to rely on perfectly timed counter spark. Okay. So like that. Oh, not like that though. Oh my god, I thought I was gonna stop him. Oh my lord, dude. Oh, I'd have to shoot him from that angle. Just throw all this shit at him. There we go. I think I jumped over that. Uh oh. Take that explosive barrel, you bitch. Ooh, those deflects are hard to time sometimes. Oh, you can block both the hits, I see. Yo, is he gonna hit, or does he only hit when I fucking play as him? There we go. Don't hit, hit the other barrel. Okay. Fucking Matthew Perry. Oh. There we go. Huh. What in the world? Okay. The blue demon. We're fucked. And I'm dead. Oh my god. Well, we got fucking annihilated by the blue demon. Jesus. The combat <clears throat> combat is a little bit difficult. It's it's kind of odd because they want you to do all these parries and deflects, but there's so many combo moves and like time hard to time attacks and live and take the secret message. Live and take the wait what? Live and take the secret message. So which do you deed? Oh yeah, I see. Are you sure you want to be cho this chosen to be your protagonist? Yes. I'll choose me as this is where I get to choose who. Oh, my brother! This is what he would do, to be honest. No! How's he gonna do combos in Mortal Kombat now? Do I recognize the voice? I think so. That's Owl, right? Dude, that's fucking Owl. Sick, he sounds badass. Owl's voice is voice actor is so badass, he sounds so cool. Oh.
information added about my brother. Oh, what? What happened here? Oh, shit. I see anything. Uh oh. The ninjas. Wow. Fuck, I thought he was going to do an attack. So those are attacks I can only deflect, huh? This time, that one. <clears throat> oh no, I didn't deflect because I was on top of the stupid ass rock. Blade Flash. <clears throat> Shake off blood stains and replenish key based on the blood stain amount. Oh, so like Neo. I didn't even know that was a thing. This game. I'm dead. Oh, 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 oh. Fuck that one up. Oh, I'm dead. No, I dodged. <laughs> I dodged fucking backwards, and then the knife caught up to me. I swear I didn't see any of the key pulses. Can I maybe assassinate one of them? Maybe not. Uh oh. There's a third in here? Oh my gosh, another one, I think. There's a fucking dog! Doggy! Psst, 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 psst. You fucking mutt! Maybe I can train him and he'll be mine. I won't. Well, at least you can't chop his head off. I lost all my heals. Oh, well, I could have gone around. Look at that. If I would have gone left, I probably would have been able to crouch and sneak my way around behind one of them. So at least now you know, right? Like, there's multiple ways to do stuff. If you want to do stuff more stealthily, you can. Oh, yeah. I would have been able to sneak over here and kill one of them, at least. For sure. Ooh, I got shrieken. L2. There's so many buttons. Aw, not a usual curse. R1 plus down. If I want to use a different weapon. What was the button again? Was it R1? R1 for the, uh... Oh wow, so you can throw a shuriken, like, real strong. What was the key pulse? It was R1, right? I think it was R1. Mm -mm 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 
There we go. That's good. Yeah, I don't really want people just randomly coming in here. That's their first comment. Oh, I love the animations. Okay, so that's a weird poke. These attacks are hard to gauge. Oh, I'm fucking dead, dude. My guy still got his speed. Oh my god. I never understand what is it with some people, right? That they just they like some people are just this stance is sick by the way. Some people can't um just enjoy multiple things. What is it with like one fan base and stuff like that that has to like see things that are similar to it and go, oh, this is better than that. That's garbage. Why can't two things just coexist? So for context, somebody came in to say like, uh, like, oh, this game's garbage compared to Ghost of Tsushima, which sure, like it looks like Ghost of Tsushima. It kind of plays a little bit like it, but why can't people just enjoy that there's two games that are similar? And genre and fucking awesome. You know? Oh shit. We could try a little bit of stealth. I wonder if I can even assassinate somebody from here though. I think I can maybe get one of these guys. Look at him walking and he's stuck on some. Oh, well, that was the worst timing. Did he got fucking unstuck. Ouchie, my stomach is open. Oh. No way, am I gonna spawn all the way back? God damn it. Am I boycotting Dragon's Dogma? No, fuck no. I think it's fucking awesome. Fuck, I spawned all the way back here. We could try our stealth now. Can I get any more? Or is that it? Dog. Hey, follow your goddamn knees. There you go. Oh, 
Oh, I missed. <laughs> Can you step on fire in this game? Oh, there he is. Alright, how many do we have here? Is it just a one? Come here! Wait, so I replace my other... Does the shuriken replace my gun? I think that's what it did. We need some good dual swords now. I want to go back to using dual swords. Oh. I can stuck on nothing. Got him from the side of the neck a little bit. There is a crow. <laughs> oh, I could have gotten it on the roof here. Wait, I could get on the tree now. Ooh. So then I probably could probably could have plunged the other guy, killed his ass. Shurikens. Oh yeah, I wanted to see. So, oh yeah, so the shurikens do replace that. And then I probably swap them the same. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Yeah, this game is PS5 exclusive. And their whole 5 million... Oh, shit. 5 million sales figure is crazy. Because they... It came out the same day as fucking... Dragon's Dogma. For them to be like, we want to sell 5 million copies is so, like... There's just no way, dude. I don't exactly know who chose their date first, but... I think this game should not have come out the same day as Dragon's Dogma because nobody's playing it. You know, it's got had less views than fucking Hearthstone on Twitch. Am I going backwards? No. Yo, I need a goddamn. Where's the flags? Oh, okay. There's gonna be one here. Is that my sensei? Sensei! Oh! Dude, that's so sick! I love how it looks. Ow. <laughs> Let's go, bitch. Oh, 
Oh. No, I wanted to grab the item. Dang it. Uh-oh. Oh shit, that's just gonna cut her arm off. You know what? I haven't done that all the key thing. Like I I don't know how to do it. I haven't seen it. Oh no, we're fighting our old lady. Alright, here we go. Oh shit. Oh shit, I tried dodging after that. Wow, it's hard sometimes to gauge. If they do a spin attack, it makes deflecting really hard. This isn't even a katana. This is a saber. You've gone senile. Oh my god. Damn it. Deflecting that was hard. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Maybe I can't deflect that one? Got the old bag! I'm sorry, Sensei! Oh my god! No! Did I cut your, your jugular by accident? What a humdrum lad you are. R.I.P. So they all have this blade twin, kind of like their brothers. You know how they say in real life, like twins can like almost telepathically communicate? Maybe it's like that. Oh no, the dogs are going to eat her. Can we at least kill her before the dogs fucking eat her alive? <laughs> 
She's like, wait, finish me off. I don't want to freeze. She lived for another four hours. Die your own death. <laughs> awesome. That was a cool opening. Flying the nest. That was a really cool opening. I really enjoyed that. And now we're on to the open world. Head to Yokohama. Oh wait, there we go. We gotta run over there. Is that a bunny? Should I kill the every bunny I see? Who are you? Merchant? Uh oh. Yatodonga,ねじろにしてるようで。わざわざ秋内に来たんですが、ここで難儀してるわけです。関所も近いってのに、お役人は何をしているのやら。Pet all my wares. Earthenware ball. I wonder if that's like a smoke bomb? A loud bang to distract. Oh, I see. That's cool. So there's a whole village of these people. Public order. Areas occupied by troublemakers will suffer from a disruption of public order and will be displayed as red on the map. Defeating all the troublemakers in an unruly area will strengthen your bond with that area. Okay, let's try this out. Is that them? You damn troublemakers! <laughs> I chop his leg off. <laughs> He's a villager. <laughs> There's one formidable foe and five regular enemies. Okay. I think that's them here. Oh, shit. You think I could get on this roof and like jump up to backstab his ass? Hopefully they didn't hear that. Assassinating from up high. Alright. YOLO. Grab his fucking ponytail. Oh! That's cool. So you could do like double assassinations. Cool. I love how brutal it is. Okay, so we put this flag up once we are uh, done with our work here. Oh shit, is that the formidable foe there? Maybe he didn't see me. He saw me. Alright, this is the formidable foe. You know I fought an old lady, right? Oh wow, that time is weird. I got his gauntlets. 
Wait, there's one more. One more regular little guy? Is that him here? What's he doing? He's farming. Oops. Oh wow, spears are hard to fucking deflect. I'll make you a new hairstyle. Is it more Neo or Ghost of Tsushima? Um, probably Neo. It's more Wulong. It's like um, it's like a mix between Wulong and Neo. If that makes any sense. What the fuck is this, by the way? I got his horse flute. Is that a priest? I obtained obtained a chestnut horse. Use a horse flute to call the horse. Oh, hey, we do have horses. Cool. <laughs> Uh, I didn't even use it. No. Oh, I want to see his items, though. I can craft stuff. Oh, okay, so I can craft shurikens. I can craft heals. So those are the items that I need to craft heals. I can carry up to 99 and store 99, but I can only hold three. I can buy endurance remedies, a bunch of stuff. Stuff for for key. Maybe a little bit of Sekido. No, it's it's more Wulong for sure than Sekido. Hello. あの、薬の材料を探してきていただけないでしょうか。このままでは。あ、okay, uh, 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 uh. uh, sure, lady. I don't have the time. <笑>本当ですか。ありがとうございます。薬は赤い花を材料にしています。Okay, so I had to gather medicinal herbs. 300 meters away? Show her feet. Show her what? What is that? Oh, dogs. Dude, I thought those were alligators. Oh, I don't like doing that. Oh, good. I got their animal fat. Auto run while mounted. The auto run ability is now available. It will automatically travel to destinations of your choosing. Huh. That's cool. What was the game that had that? It was Go Ghost of Tsushima had that, right? Oops, I took a screenshot. I got... That's what I got. Better aiming speed. Oh, I can have a little hat on. Kuba Jazzy, thank you so much for the 44 months, man. Doka Dot, thank you as well for the 28. Uh, Nikulash, thank you for the 13 months. What do I think about the Dragon Dogma PC performance? Yeah, it seems like some people are having issues. It's unfortunate. Hopefully they uh, put out a patch to kind of stabilize shit. It's been great on PlayStation, though. Uh oh. Three fucking ruffians. Ah, 
啊！Ooh, that gooch slash. You good, dog? How about a hundred percent discount? Give me all you got. What if I rob his ass now? I've attained a silver coin. Silver coins can be used transaction to conduct something with traders. Japanese inspired wear, and apparently I got some bamboo. <laughs> nice. I look fancy. Yo, I am fancy. Hey, for free though? Wait, was it as? Oh, okay, it was that. What the hell was that bamboo I got? Hey, there's our horsey. Wait, I can collect the rabbit? I just took them. Oh my, I took them and then once fell swoop skinned them. As I was picking him up. You know how crazy that is? You know how much skill that takes? Oh, can you not seek up on dogs? I don't like killing dogs. So this is another village, huh? There's another guy up there. See, and there's about three dudes in here. Oh shit, there's a guy there. I'm probably gonna get seen anyway, so might as well just end it like this, and then I'll get seen. Holy fuck, did I pop his head? They're actually on the ground for quite a bit. Uh oh. Oh. How good is blocking in this game? I haven't really even tried it. I should have deflected that one. That's such weird timing. Karma, defeating enemies earns karma. That's good. I got his, I got a, his dandy pole arm. Or that's his name. His name is Dandy. Give me all them herbs. Yo, Mio the Doge, thank you so much for the $10 donation. And ST Salt, or st Salt, thank you so much for the for the Twitch Prime sub. I appreciate using that here. Thank you. Uh, 
And yeah, Arcane Jinx, you gotta calm down, man. That's definitely not a fact. That's very, 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 very offensive. Please don't say that again. You need to watch your mouth sometimes, you know? Sometimes you say things without thinking. You gotta think twice. Always think about it this way, right? If you were saying it to somebody that was of that, would you say that to them? You know? Think about it that way next time. Oh, they s wow, they slaughtered that old ass lady. See, guys, they deserve to be dead. I'm a hero. Can I go in any of these? No. We got boots. Oh. And other armor? We got other gauntlets, too. Yo, I'm looking fancy. I'm looking good. Can I walk around naked? <laughs> yes, I can, baby. Let's go. I'm about to walk into back into the village like this, by the way. Oh, those rabbits disappeared into the wall. They're made of mist. Wait, so do I have to do anything or is this automatic? Is this like village free now? Wait, I can. I'm embarrassed. I go, oh, I forgot my clothes. I'm sorry. Please, forgive me. I'll never do it again. Public order. Oh, so it actually shows them. Oh, I forgot to... There's a cat here! We gotta go back for the cat. Let's go, Torrent. Chill. Jesus Christ. Let's go that we could collect stuff from Torrent. By the way, I love that I skinned them as I picked them up. Hello, yes, it is me. I'm back in the village. Like, who's that naked man on a horse? It's me, your savior. Here you go, madam. Your medicines. See anything you like? What happened to the leftovers? Do I have an anaconda? Yeah, he's got that. He's got that Gwendolyn action going on. It's like a king cobra. It spits like one too. <laughs> oh, sorry. Hentai, hentai. There's a pervert in the village. I thought I lit that already. Oh, this is just when you touch it. Okay. All right, head to Yokohama, which is, wait, let's go grab this cat actually. He's around here somewhere. Look at him. Let this pervert pet you, young cat. 
It ain't the only pussy I'm gonna be stroking. Let's go. It's time to fucking party. What the hell is that? Just some iron pulverized coal. Did she give me a mission? I think she just said go to the bridge, right? I think she means. Uh, Yokohama. Yeah, we gotta go to Yokohama. So we got no missions. We're just heading uh here. Yeah. Wait. So if I click that, does it give me like a road to follow? I guess it actually shows on the map now. You're in the racist chat? No, that's Lost chat. Lost My Sanity is not currently live. I heard a cat. I know I did. Oh, there's one. Hello, cat. Would you like to cheat on your husband today, madam? Can I get up here? Oh fuck, I almost pelted that seagull. So what do I do up here? How do I use that? Oh. Yeah, that's what you like, right? You want me to climb this rope slower? This game have gravity. I don't think it has gravity. Oh, it does. It's just not that bad. Can I grab those squirrels too? Give me that goddamn squirrel. A little bit of meat. Squirrel meat. Who are these people? Are these villains? Oh my god, they are. I wonder if I can deflect when they're like, I have my back turned to them. Wait, he just threw sand in my eye. He threw a little dirt in my eye. Oh my god. I probably should have taken them on when I'm naked, huh? Oh, I take some fucking damage while I'm naked. Yo, what's going on back there? What is that screaming I just heard? I'm dead. Oh! Yeah, I shouldn't have gone out there naked. That probably uh, was was a bad idea. <laughs> probably was a bad idea. A little hat. Oh shit! I gotta. Oh, so you also have set bonuses, huh? Uh, matchless master special effects. It ups your finishing attacks. Okay. The Traveler's Garb. Okay, I see. What a humdrum lad you are. Thank you. Uh, Dombo War, thank you for the five month sub. A vendetta has been initiated with some random little guy.
I'm gonna just jump up and backstab him. Going this way. Can I? Well, that didn't work. Vendetta has been s satisfied. Really, dude? Oh shit, oh shit! I'm trying to deflect more, it's just tough. Oh my god. I died at this guy? Again? Well, technically, I died in one of the other ones. <laughs> yeah, the deflects are, are pretty tough to get, honestly. Because, like, the moves are so delayed and the deflect has to be very precise. I don't know if they have it set so that if it's a harder yeah. difficulty, the deflex are harder too. <laughs> Probably should just kill one of the other ones, but that's fine. I know who to lock on to. <laughs> okay, so they do three moves. again son of a bitch this guy's tough this one fucking little guy all right sam you have a good one Third time's a charm. Yeah, he's literally the main character of the video game. I think he's the main character. Oh, I should have caught that squirrel. Wait, can I put a banner up here? I thought that was a cat up here.
A shinobi cowl. Oh, sweet. This will hide my identity. Ow, my legs. Can I quickly get one? Oh, okay, so we got two instantly. He's trained them so Oh my god, he's gonna kill me a third time! I guess this is good practice to practice deflex on this guy. Double move, okay. Oh, to satiate your revenge, you just have to hit him with a little, like, riposte? He's a goddamn god! Oh my god, finally! You're garbage, bro! Get good! Oh, I don't know why I wasted a heal. I got a paralytic whetstone, though. I want a better dual katana. Oh, that's the pole arm we got. Ooh, maybe I'll try the Odachi. <laughs> His feet are gross. He got sandals without socks. They have sandals with socks, sandals without socks. Should you play this one? What's my opinion? The game is great so far. What's up this way? Can I kill the horse, or is he good? I think he's good jumping from any height, to be honest. Oh, shit. Good shot. Oh, well, that fuck that one up. Well, fuck me. Well, that was went bad. Well, that went bad. Come here. Oh, I know you can do that. I hear a cat. <gasps> Hello. 
No, he doesn't like me. That one's mean. I burned that dog. Honestly, I fucking burned myself too. Huh? This fucking dog. Die, you stupid dog. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Uh-oh. You think the dog's got a heal on him? Ah! Run into the ocean. Heal, 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 heal. Ah. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. That's a fourth move hit, okay. I missed. Oh, fuck. Okay, I spawned out here. But what about the cat? Can I swim? What are these barnacles? The hell is that? Oh my god, I thought that was a shark. I'm sure they hear that. I should have come out there and shot more explosives at the guy. Fuck out my way, dog. No. But he tricked me. Oh, I missed. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> you saw his face? He went dishonest! <laughs> As I shot him in the sternum with a fucking bazooka. Got him. We got that cat, right? That's my cat? A couple of clams. Uh. Is that a villain? Oh, I was about. Hey, I was about to stealth. You gotta watch out, man. I took his meat. Ooh, there's like buildings. Oh, I got some water. This game is very pretty. I like the colors.
We're still heading to Yokohama. Can I climb this? I don't think there's anything up here. Yo, let's head into town! There's a madman in town! Hello, it is me! Is this the guy I'm supposed to talk to? Hey, Top Knot! You can see a group of enemies level on the map. Oh, okay. Where's your permit? I, I don't have one. Aww. Would money do the trick? <laughs> what a dick. I love, by the way, that it, I, I don't have my armor in the cutscenes. Hello, homeless people. I got a, what is that, a fucking uh, uh, onion? I got some red nuts. Don't worry, I'll get my chance to kill him. I'll get my revenge on him. Oh shit. Yo, how many villages have been overrun? Fuck, there's a guy with a shield in here? I'll take one out. Right, I'm gonna try the Odachi out. Look at him fucking shield blocking the little bitch. Oh, get shit on. Shield block my red nuts, dude. Oh, I got a bow. Cool. Oh, I see him. Okay, Odachi's pretty cool. I think I might like the Odachi more than the Saber. How many more? Where is he? What? Oh my god, the dog spotted me first. That's a cool move. 
Whoa, fuck me. You need to calm down, you humdrum lad. Oh, two hit combo. There we go. And then 45 days pass. I'm gonna be an old man by the time I get done freeing all the camps. All right, I like this weapon more than the other one. What are you guys doing, harassing her? Get away from her. Who's this? A horse salesman? Buy and sell horses. Oh, chain horse. So we have the chestnut horse. We can buy a real fast horse, I think. Primary mounted attack. Ooh. This one has a shit ton of stamina. It costs 13 good points. Whatever, you know, I don't know what it's called. What it's called, I mean. I'll save it. You know what? I've got it attached to the horse. How's the story of the game so far? It seems pretty interesting. It looks like it'll pick up. Village chief. It's probably the oldest little guy over here. Yeah, that's him. That's him. And hey, better dodge. Who were they? Bastards. Ooh. That's mine. Oh, the boss is still going to be there. I'm going to go grab their loot. Oh, they have the permit there. Cool. Hey, Chokushi, thank you so much for the 17 long months sub. Shocked you didn't make a monster in the character creator? Yeah, it's mainly because I made a monster in Dragon's Dogma, so I thought I'd make a normal one here. You know, to kind of to kind of break it up a little bit. We gotta spread the monsters apart. Who's this old lady? She sells stuff. Oh wow, I can already make that many heals? Oh shit, it costs 200 each? I didn't even realize that. Quick math, so what's 200 times 15? Because that's what I just spent. 2,500? 2,600? 2,500? here 3k okay well i'm gonna get it back petting cats don't worry all right let's go for our reward in this cave do, do they still run oh they do so what do i how do i take his animal fat while he's still alive Seems kind of brutal. Oops. Some iron ore, some heels. Oh, is this the cave? What's going on over here? It looks like somebody's getting fucking attacked. 
Let's go help him. Oh. You know what's annoying about the deflex? Like, you can't do them instantly. So I mean, you kind of have this animation you're stuck in for a little bit after you attack. I broke his sword. No, 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 no. If that one little guy killed me, I would have been so angry. Ow. Get his ass guy with a weird hat. Son of a bitch is tough. Damn. That guy was tough. What is that hat? What an insane hat. The Wandering Samurai Odachi. Cool. Neo Dachi? Purple. And then we got a spear. What's the other armor I just got? Okay, we got that. Is uh is weight a thing in this? Martial arts key attack up. Okay, I'll do that. He has like little dress shoes with no socks. That's wild. That's just crazier than the... What? I got a beckoning cat. So I get more drops for medicine. Cool. It's an accessory. I thought it would be like on my person. Is the game worth buying? It's been pretty fucking fun so far. Oh shit, there's somebody else in here. What the hell? Ow. I love how he's staring at me. Oh shit, there's Lula. Why are there ninjas in here? What? Okay. Is this guy good, maybe? Ooh. That guy's cool. He kind of looks like the default character. <laughs> the plink plink plot was perfect. <laughs> Eccentric Ronin. Tag along with me. We got a buddy. Cool. 
Oh my god, look at his head. Holy shit. Alright, let me see what's in here first. So are we gonna go in the cave together? Is there a cat here? Some ore. Let me check for cats. Nothing. Kick the door down. His pistol does it cool. I got a calabash gourd. Super power remedy. Can I pet a chicken? I collected his feathers. What a mean thing to do. I just swiped a couple of his feathers. Oh, okay, so he was doing the same thing I was. Ooh, so maybe the old man was trying to trick us. The mob guy? Is that the voice actor? Oh shit. この辺の門を溜め込んじょるそうやきのまあ手下もそこそこおるじゃろうがお前の腕なら造作もなかろうどうじゃ手形を取りに行かんかいおう、oh, fuck yeah, let's go steal! No, best not. <laughs> nah, I'm good. I'm gonna do it the right way and bribe the guard. Allegiance and allies. Some missions will allow you to partner with allies whose unique skills will help you make progress in the game. Select allies. Okay. Cool. The eccentric Ronin, who is obviously very charismatic. Can I choose him twice? <laughs> him and his clone? And I could also, like, choose my weapons, huh? The mass-produced Uchigatana. It does more damage in nighttime for some reason. Huh? There's the bow. Huh. Alright. Let's do it. So now I can swap to him. And we do missions and shit. I guess it must just be this one mission. Defeat three formidable foes. Okay. Alright, how much can we get away with doing stealth? Or are they already in here? Okay, I see. That's so cool, dude. I love that. What is... What's going on? Oh, what are you up to, dude? Oh, 
Oh, fuck. This must be one of the formidable foes, maybe? Assuming neither of them were the bandit chiefs. <laughs> Look at him just sitting there. Maybe he's just sleeping. I got an egg. Oh, look at that. So I could have gone around, too. Shit. This is a formidable foe. We might not be able to one-shot this guy. The Tenchi uh, Jin combat styles are effective against different weapons. Effective, ineffective. While the protagonists... Ineffective against Odachi's... Wait, what? Mu Ryu. Mio, Mumio Ryu. Is ineffective against Odachi's, the eccentric Ronin's Hokushin Ito Ryu style is effective. You will have an easier time fighting if you switch characters under your control. Interesting. It actually like tells you, huh? Uh oh. So his style is better to fight the main guy. Okay. Ah! <laughs> Let's go, bitch. I don't think he likes being down here. Oh, could have like that one. Oh, he hit me in the dick. Hey, that is me in the back. That was crazy. I got a silver weapon. Or a green weapon. Can I get up this way? So it actually tells you what they're weaker to. That's pretty cool. I kind of like that. I got a new rifle. Oh shit! That's a strong ass katana. I'm about to try that shit. The Uchi? And a strong pistol. Or a gun. Oh my god, I could just wear a suit. Did that say medicinal case? Is this this? Oh, okay. I thought it was gonna let me carry an extra heal. I wanna try this katana I got. So we gotta go this way. What the? What was he? He was frozen. So this guy's fighting style is better against this guy.
It's a cool move, though. I like his moves. Who the hell's that? There's a little old guy over here. Oh. <laughs> I thought he was playing the guitar, to be honest. Oh, shit. I don't think we'll be able to stealth either of these. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh my god, so lucky. This guy's a beast. He's way better than I am. I got a hunter's cap. Is that just a little hat for me? Just a little, a little hat. I look like a peasant. I look like one of those guys who goes, uh, the paper. Who sells the papers on the street. But as like a street urchin. Oh, shit, there's a guy there. There was a guy there. Don't mind if I come in, right? Okay, so this guy's a formidable opponent. I'm out of heels. Yay! That was really close. What the hell? Who the hell's this guy? A rare skill points from strengthening my bonds. Menu and then stats. Oops. Menu, stats. Keep an eye on your Ronin bonds in this historical era. Completing missions your tasks with a Ronin will increase your Ronin bonds, which will turn, which will in turn bring you items and increase your influence. What did I get? Does it show? Hey, Darken Guard, what's up? Bonds. Oh, so you actually have full things that you have to do. It shows me the percentage of everything. So it's just six skill points that I can use, huh? Okay. After dealing a blow, R1 plus up to switch primal weapons. Unleash a barrage of critical hits. I already have that, right? Ooh. 
Let's do that. That looks cool. Grappling rope. I'll do that. L1 plus spin shurikens. X in midair to leap off an enemy while dealing Kai damage after landing on them once. Okay. That sounds kind of awesome. What about charm? Number of coins. Amount of Kai recovered a blade flash. I'm going to be honest. I haven't been even doing that blade flash. I... I think it's pressing R1. I don't see it. I haven't been able to see it. I don't know if it's the same where it like flashes of when you're supposed to do it and stuff. Do you always have to parry in combat in this game? No, you can block, you can dodge. Gives you the option to tell lies to your interlocu in interlocutor. I can start lying. Yo. Oh. I was going to start lying. It allows you to craft power, endurance, and anti key remedies. Persuasions? Fire your handgun with L2 while dodging. We haven't even gotten a handgun yet. Increase damage to guns. Okay. All right. I like the uh, the skill tree. It seems a lot simpler than. Look how many moves there are, though. Oh my god! There's like a whole move list. It seems a lot simpler than Neo, for sure. I'm gonna have to start selling stuff. We don't want stuff to pile up and then we have 40 different items. I can set my weapon on fire. Ooh, paralytic. Paralyzing thing. Maybe we'll try that against like the next big enemy we see. So what was the special skill I got from the other guy? Is it this one? Gives you the option to intimidate your interlocutor during conversations? I only have one dex point. Is there anything that cost one? Okay. Upgrade. I can upgrade my weapons using iron. That seems like a waste, to be honest. Like, I feel I'm just going to get strong weapons in five seconds. Oh, I can also disassemble stuff. Ah, okay. If I disassemble, I get, like... Some items? What about weapons? Oh yeah, look at that. I get like the iron for them.
So maybe you just get a bunch anyway, so. Just keep the strongest. My wooden Odachi. I get a, a fucking piece of wood for that. Alright. Cool. Yeah, there's no point in like leveling up. I bet I might get a strong ass weapon here pretty soon. Oh, I could have came in from up here too. Is that a chest? Oh, yeah, look at that. Find the bandit chief. He's probably up this way. <coughs> the heck is this way? Oh, is that a Miyazaki door? So his fighting style is better in this game. Oh my god. He said, what are you? Yikes. Ah, oh, he's dead. I revived him. God damn it. Holy fuck! Yo, he whooped my little ass. Well then, let us try that again. That guy seems scary. Wait, what? Why are they back? I feel like that should have happened, right? Please die. Maybe we can shoot the other guy with the gun. <laughs> Fucking get shot, bitch. His name is fucking Gonzo, like the Muppet. Oh.
He missed. Ow. He just kind of hits me uh, with a light tap on the head. There we go. That guy was tough. <laughs> What's in it for me? Oh, okay. That's the key. Mm. I was gonna get that anyways if you're dead. So. Mm. You think this is gonna save your life? You're out of luck! No mercy. Alright, thank you so much for the gifted sub. Chokushi with the 10! Freaking gifted sub. Freaking memberships. Oh my god. Hey, enjoy them all, everybody. Thank you so much, Chokushi. I appreciate it. Hopefully everybody enjoys all the gifted subs. Make sure you guys give a nice thank you if you got gifted a sub. I appreciate it very much. What did I get? I got the checkpoint permit. Old bond. Wait, so did I get the did I get the key to his storage as well? No, and then I kill him. No, probably better not. <laughs> そこで落ち合うぜよ。おらんようならその辺りで坂本龍馬はどこじゃ。龍馬坂本。おいたら、またの。Cool. So did I end up getting the key anyways? I hope I did. I thought I would get that anyways if I killed his ass, you know? Establishing and strengthening bonds. Oh, I didn't give him uh, flowers. Yeah, I got it. Fuck him then. You know? Look, I got his Odachi as well. Hell yeah. I'm glad I killed his ass. Look at that. Oh my god. That's a beast. Mighty warrior. Didn't I have an armor that had that? Oh, it has two fighting styles, too. Two stances, I guess. Oh, there it is. Mighty Warrior. Oh, this is all the armor. I got all the Mighty Warrior armor. This one is actually matchless master. And that comfortable leather shoes. Ooh. We got three of them. Higher damage, less kai key consumption when guarding. Nullify helmet for headshots? Hell yeah.
Switch combat styles. R1 plus right. Oh, okay. So this is one of the combat styles, and then we have our regular one. So if one combat style is bad, we can swap to a different one. Sick. Should have let him live. He's a good ally. I'd rather have his armor and weapons. Now, do you also get those if you let him live or no? I got some red nuts. Ooh, a glider. That's cool. It depletes your key. So that's how we get the glider. Y'all hear any cats around here? We're on the lookout for cats. Maricus tits. Cool. We're going down. We can't crash. <laughs> Force of gravity. Thank you so much for the gift itself. I'm assuming that's for overcoming gravity with wings. It's right here, you bald bitch. About the games that don't want spoilers? Alright, that sounds good. I'm probably going to finish up here soon anyways. I kind of had to re-upload my video. It just broke and never processed, so... I have to actually re-upload it. This game is actually a lot of fucking fun, man. I'm fucking loving it so far. Is this hard to play like Lies of P or any Souls games? There's difficulty settings, so if you're having a hard time, you can always turn it down. But honestly, right now, playing on the hardest difficulty is not that bad. It feels to me like what Team Ninjas wanted people to play as, but you know, with how things are nowadays, they kind of got to add uh, difficulties. Who's this old guy? Uh-oh. Did he steal something? He stole a fish! Why is there a guy in the back just like shirtless? Lock difficulties or am I in the highest difficulty? Yeah, I'm in the highest difficulty. Twilight, I think it's called. You see the guy's thong ass back there? God damn, I hate that's the first thing I noticed. He's wearing a thong. Put a pair of pants on. They exist. Yo, Mio the Doge. Oh my god, thank you so much for the 20! Freaking dollar super chat. Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Hey, fighter! Thank you so much for the raid, man. Welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. 
Hopefully your stream went well, dude. I appreciate the raid. You might have caught me right at the end of it, but... Thank you, dude. Yo, look at that cake on her. Holy shit. She built like an ant. Uh, what are these? Endurance remedies. Consume temporarily deal more damage. Oh, interesting. So I can sell, like, old weapons and stuff too, right? How much can I sell shit for? 40? That's it. I'd rather dismantle them. I can make 14 more heals for 3,000. Back to Elden Ring and Souls games? Hey, that's good to hear, dude. Gonna go sleep in the A. You have a good one, fighter. Hopefully you start uh, enjoying all the, the Elden Ring and Souls games again. I appreciate the raid, man. I want to take the feathers of a chicken. Mine. Get plucked. So we're heading over here. Alright, you know what though? I think this might be a good place to stop it. After I pluck these two birds. You see how they react? Oh my god, I took their eggs! Yo, how did I reach in there and grab them? Oh my god. That was brutal. I just got in there with my hands and grabbed it. Alright, ladies and germs. I think we're gonna have to stop it there. Oh, this is sick though. Cool. Alright. Unfortunately, I think we had to stop it there for now. I uh, I scheduled my video for like literally 4 p.m. It should have been live already. But um, you encounter another Ronin in towns of the road. Defeating them will increase your proficiency in their weapons and will earn. Oh, should I just go in there and fuck another Ronin up? That's what they get for crossing my goddamn path. All right. Like I said, I unfortunately have to re-upload it. And I do it while I'm live, but the stream would probably go down, so... I appreciate everybody coming out. Sorry it wasn't like super long. I'll for sure be back tomorrow. And maybe we'll double it up and maybe we'll do... Oh, I don't even know what I'm going to do to be honest. I need to do Dark Souls 2. I need to finish freaking poorly translated. We got a lot of stuff to do. So we'll see what we do tomorrow. But I appreciate everybody hanging out today. Uh, thank you to all the subs on YouTube. All the followers on Twitch. Thank you to all the donations. All the gifted subs. And uh, anybody on YouTube, if you're still in here, do me a huge solid and leave a like before you head out on the live stream. It always helps out the live stream whenever the video goes live. So thank you. If you miss anything, the VODs are going to be up on both YouTube and Twitch. So feel free to watch anywhere you want. Have yourselves a wonderful rest of your day, everybody. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.